you want somebody to invest in you or your business, right? Got it. The question is, how much money have you invested in yourself? Hello, beautiful people. It is your girl, Miss Charlotte. If this is your first time visiting my platform, thank you and welcome. We deal with our issues here. And on Fridays, I am either ranting or giving tips, you know, for creators or hustlers looking to make extra money during COVID or just, you know, tips or whatever I can come up with outside of the box. I like to try to share that with you. And I've shared a couple already. And the reason why I'm kind of ranting today is because some people are actually saying that the tips may cost them money. You have to invest in yourself. If you want somebody to give you $5, $500, $500,000, $5 million, the first thing they're going to want to know is how much have you personally invested in yourself and your project or in your business. It doesn't matter how much they want to know if you have because you want them to take their personal money and to invest it in you, but you have not taken any of your own personal money to invest in yourself. Like, where they do that at? <laughs> Seriously, where they do that at? It, I mean, just put yourself in that kind of shoe, all right? Somebody's asking you for your money to invest in their stuff and you go to them and it turns out they haven't invested a dime. They're just looking to spend your money. It's not cool, okay? So when I give tips and when I give advice, a lot of it is free, but there are some things, the basic things that you need, whatever it is that you're doing, you're going to need to pay for some basic stuff and you should because this is something you want to do. So it may be a new computer, it may be a new phone, it may be apps, it may be a piece of technology, it may be a course, whatever it is, you need to invest in the basics. You are your first and sometimes your only investor. You're definitely your first seed investor. Now this is your plant to grow. You put this seed in the ground and if you're not willing to put any water on it, then why should I come along and put some water on your seed? You understand what I'm saying? You want it to grow, but you want everybody else to, to plant it, to put the water on it, to make sure you take all the dead leaves off of. You don't want to do nothing. You just want to sit and just let somebody plant your seed and grow it and then you just eat all the fruit. Ciao. Bye. Okay? That's not happening. So... I'm ranting a little, but that is my piece of advice. Really think about what it is that you need to do. And don't try to say, oh, it's going to cost a lot of money because you spend money on the things that you want. Sometimes not even the things you need. Okay. If you have a vice, how much do you spend on your vice? Let's say you smoke cigarettes. How much money do you spend on your cigarettes? You drink beer. How much you drink, you know, how much you spending on your beer? Weed. How much you spending on your weed? or whatever else you're doing, okay? You wanna get your nails done, how much you spend on your nails? You wanna get your hair done, how much you spend on your hair? You out here dating all types of fabulous chicks, how much money are you spending on those chicks? The point is you have the money, but do you really want to invest in yourself? And if you don't wanna spend the money to invest in yourself, then all I'm saying is do not expect others to invest in you because you don't want to invest in yourself. If you understand what I'm talking about, give me the thumbs up. If you don't, thumbs down. We can agree to disagree. If you believe somebody is going to plant your seed, water it, feed it, take care of it, and let you eat off the fruit and you have to do nothing, then you know what? Hit me up and tell me where they do that at because I want to (laughs) know. If you're watching this on my YouTube channel, please subscribe to help me to get my numbers up. If you're watching this on my Facebook page, please like my page and share. And if you're watching this on my IGTV, please follow and share. And until next week, I'll see you later.